We are here with the iconic, the legendary Paula Abdul. How's it going tonight? Well, you're a sweetheart. <laughs> I'm, I'm still buzzing. I was guest judging Dancing with the Stars last night and then took a red eye here, and I'm so excited to be here. Uh, and I always say country music pierces the heartstrings, and uh, I love that melodies are still so important and storytelling is so important, and the hooks are beautiful. I feel like, you know, that gets oftentimes lost in pop music. Yes. It's just nice and refreshing to be able to, I don't have to judge anyone. <laughs> I get to be front and center watching the magnificent talent and collaborations and tributes. I'm very excited. And Country also excited. It, I'm sorry, I just had to say, and also to see my girl Carrie Underwood. Oh yes, we love her. I'm so very, very proud of her. She's handled her whole career with such dignity, grace, and she's relentless. Mm -hmm. she's, I call her the bullet train. She keeps going. Putting you on the spot, do you have a favorite song of hers? Oh my gosh. <laughs> well, for me, it'll always be Jesus Take the Wheel because that was from the moment she won to, to you know, going into that song. It was... I will always be sentimental, but I'm a huge fan of hers. Yeah, of course. They're all hits, right? <laughs> yes, I'm, I'm a huge fan of so many. Like, my idols are here tonight, so I'm so excited. That's so awesome. We're so happy to have you here. Thank you. I need to ask about the Magic Summer Tour. Yes. How cool is that? What can you tell us? Well, me and my buddies, New Kids on the Block, we're hitting the road in June, July, and August, and I believe we're doing 47 cities. And... Um, What's so cool is that both both of us are celebrating our 35th anniversary of our first albums. There's Hanging Tough, my favorite girl. So it's gonna be nostalgic, and everyone yeah. will be singing every lyric of every <laughs> song, and it's just gonna be fun. I, I'm also producing my very first Broadway show. Oh my gosh! And it's called How to Dance in Ohio, and it's based off of the HBO critically acclaimed documentary of the same name, How to Dance in Ohio. And they made it into a musical, and this is my first time, and I'm so proud to be aligned with this. It's, it's wonderful. It's about young adults who are on the autistic spectrum mm. getting ready for their first formal dance. That's and incredible. they made it into a musical, and it, it's history-making because never before on Broadway, the lead cast of all seven of them are on the autistic spectrum. Congratulations. That's Thank beautiful. You. I'm so excited. It's going to leave everyone's heart completely full. And then I'd need to ask before we let you go, you're a big Taylor Swift fan. You congratulated her on 1989. I certainly did. When was the last time you saw her? What, did you get to go to the Eras tour? I went to the Eras tour and I was literally blown away. There was so much beautiful sensory overload. Everything was so gorgeous. Mm -hmm. She was magnificent. She had the entire stadium in the palm of her hands. And to see her growth as an entertainer and her confidence it's just, I'm just so proud of her. She's incredible.